This is Liz, I'm a certified technician, and today we're going to be discussing how to turn your touchscreen on and off on your Acer computer. If you find this in any way helpful, please like and share. So, first thing you're going to do is go to File Explorer. And then you, uh, now, unfortunately, we're going to have to use a backdoor approach to this because they don't make a real easy on and off button. You're going to go down to this PC, and you're going to right click, and then you're going to hit Manage. And then we're going to go to Device Manager. And then you're going to look for Human Interface Devices. You're going to click on that expand it and then you're going to go down to HID compliant touchscreen there might be more than one of these you need to disable uh, but just to show you uh, that uh, you can just see my touchscreen right now is enabled because on let me just do this and then as you can see it click 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 it's currently enabled so and then I'm going to right click on this and I'm going to hit disable device yes and let me just move my mouse to the side here. All right, and then click, 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 click. Nothing happens. So uh, that is how you temporarily disable it. It will not. It's not a permanent fix because when you restart your computer, well, re-enable it. Also, you can just hit enable device, but that's how you can turn it on and off on your own. Uh, I'm gonna leave mine on because I love my touchscreen. I don't like turning it off. I use it all the time. Uh, but anyway, that is how you would turn off your touchscreen. Thanks for watching our video. If you found it in any way helpful, please like and share. If you like do-it-yourself computer repair videos, then go ahead and subscribe. If you have any questions or comments, leave them down below and one of our certified repair technicians will answer you. But anyway, from one egghead to another egghead, this is Liz signing out.